Day one, self-isolation. So Sunei, myself, Laura, have been tested positive for COVID-19. Uh, and this is day one of self-isolation. So the doctor said we need to isolate for a period of 10 days. Is this as bad mm -mm. as it sounds or is this a break where we are forced to just do as little as possible, go to as few, few places as possible? Um, well, we don't know. This is just day one. We'll see how, how it pans out. Yeah. Symptom-wise, babe, how are you feeling? Much better than last week. Okay. Last week had blocked nose, um, loss of smell and taste. It's so good. Um, body aches, um, dizziness. Mm. And now I've just still got the dizziness and a um, little bit of headache. Yeah, yes. And, and tired, very, very tired. Very, very yeah, that's, tired. I suppose that's why they tell us to self-isolate and do as little as possible and um, just to just to relax and recover rest and recover so for me symptom wise uh, the most annoying thing is not being able to smell or taste anything that is so so annoying so you've got all of this food you you ate um, but you're just eating for the sake of it you can't taste or smell anything Let's see how this, these 10 days go. Um, we'll try and do a daily diary, daily vlog uh, thing, just to keep record uh, of, of the 10 days. Um, and see who survives. This morning, Isla, Isla was, <laughs> she knows. <laughs> she was, she had one of her tantrums and she cried for like, what, like five minutes straight? And I thought to myself, yo, how are we going to survive 10 days? Could be interesting in our little 90 square meters. But let's see how it goes. But the Frikaners always gespeel it or sing it with the Spanish flu, babe. Yeah, I think it's with the Spanish flu. With the Spanish flu. But this is also a, a, a bad, well, a somber um, a betekenis after that. You hear the words. So uh, now can we sing it again. Ring, ring, rosy, pack it full of poses, a tissue, a tissue. We all fall down! With COVID. With COVID. That's what I'm saying. Yeah, COVID. <laughs> Who's responsible for all of this? Huh? Ah? Isla? Why? Why, why, why? Huh? Look at the ice so like. the the designs and lines of flowers and they got out of the car and their crowds were there and there was a Diana shame it felt like minutes it was only seconds and no one knew one of my favorite stuff to watch what documentaries about Diana a royal family family in Diana yeah ah uh, okay and it was suddenly like the Ayla is doing laundry. We found a way to entertain her. 
the simple things in life. Sixty-three percent of adults vaccinated in the UK. So Sunay and I are we watching Sky News, and in India there are fires that never stop burning, fires that burn the whole day, and there is people that are being cremated. People are dying on the sidewalks. Because the hospitals, um, there aren't enough staff at the hospitals and not enough oxygen supply. Yeah, Yo, that, that's so... Ah, that's scary, that's morbid, that's... Yo, I don't think that's a good idea to be watching stories like that while we are in self-isolation, day one. But it shows that we're fortunate. There's always a place in the world where it's worse, where things are a little bit worse than we have it at the moment. Sky News, okay, <laughs> that's Sky News telling us that. And in the UK, on a better, more positive side, while well, the first world country, 63% of adults have been vaccinated, had their first doses. Okay, it's in some places the pictures are better than others. Yeah. No, no, no. That's million guys. I come here. But you know where you don't go. Sure. I want to go and show you something awesome that we didn't notice. Well, <laughs> first time since Isla's since Isla's birth. Born. Yeah, since Isla's been born. Yeah, since Isla's birth, something is working. Come, come, okay. <laughs> Can you guys see there? This is a straat lucht to die. You have never seen it. This is a straat lucht. This is a straat lucht. You see there? Boop, boop, boop. That's all. The street light is actually working. The street light is burning. Yo! Can you see that? That's the first time since Isla's birth that the street light is actually working. I used to run here up and down in the dark at night. Terrible. 